Welcome back, Pokepur Nation. Hope y'all having an excellent day today. We have a triple set battle between XY Evolutions, uh, Burning Shadows, and Hidden Fates. You could get a Zard in every one of these sets, and we are doing a regular point system in today's battle. Well, not a point system, but we're going to do the... The amount as far as the value of the cards, the average price on TCGplayer.com. And we're going to start with the Evolution set because it's the first set in the three, uh, chronologically. As far as it came out, you know, this is the first set that came out. If you get the Charizard in this set, it is worth approximately $100. It's probably about $95 from what I remember. But uh, you could also get the Reverse. So we're going to see who wins today's battle. We got four packs apiece. Hope y'all love this video. I know I'm about to. But uh, <clears throat> let me know down in the comments if you like this kind of thing or what you what you like on the channel. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's see who can win today's epic triple battle. Triple set battle. All right. We got a Caterpie. I'm a Choke. Reverse and a Dugong. So, so far, Evolution's not doing too good. Evolutions is more of like a popular set, <clears throat> but uh, as far as the value for the Charizard is not as much as Burning Shadows or Hidden Face, of course. With, the, with that being said, those cards are a lot harder to pull, I believe, from uh, what the community says and everything, and I haven't gotten one yet either, so you can, the Burning Shadows Charizard Rainbow GX is worth approximately about uh, $400, like maybe $3. $3.95. So we're going to go ahead and see what it could do today. If we could get it. We never got any of these Charizards before. Only the reverse Charizard from the Evolution set. So let's see if we could get one today. Look at that. We got... It's always cool to have that. You got the regular Noibat, then the reverse Noibat. And we got a Lycanroc GX. Burning Shadows coming out the gate hot with an Ultra Rare. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. I don't know if I have that one yet. So far, it's winning. If you have not already, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button with the bells and the notifications. And leave me any comment down below. I will get back to you in full detail. Uh, in, re in response or whatever. You know what I mean. So let's see what we got. Four from the back. Hidden Fates is my favorite set of all time. And uh, Shining Fates is as well. So let's see what we can get. Sabrina Suggestion, Charmeleon. Misty's Determination, Jigglypuff, <clears throat> Coffee, Staryu, Atkins. And we still have not gotten the, the shiny Charizard out of this set either, or the shiny Umbreon, which is worth about, I think it's worth about $100, or, or like $110 for the Umbreon. And if you get the shiny Charizard, you could get over $500 for him. Straight up. So we got a Darkness Energy. And we got a Blaine's Last Stand. Darkness Energy should be at least $1.50 to $2. So it looks like Hidden Face is in second right now. But it will change, you know. I just ate me some Popeye, so... I might be uh, still digesting it right now, so... Try not to belch out loud. My little sister hates that word, belch. So I'm trying not to burp. Out loud, in case you're watching, sis. All right, we got our second Evolutions pack. Got to remember three from the back. All right. <clears throat> Here comes Team Rocket. That's a secret rare, actually, which I don't think it's worth more than a dollar, so I won't put it up if it isn't. But we will check just in case. We got a Nidoran. A Nidorino Reverse Uncommon. And we got the beautiful... Blastoise EX Mega Baby. Mega Blastoise EX. He is one of the best cards you can get, like right below the Charizard, uh, the Mega Charizard EX. Yes, we already got the Venusaur like this and the Charizard. So this is the third one that we needed out of those three. So awesome to have the new set. And it looks like Evolutions is starting to play hardball right now. So let's see. Best card I pulled from Evolutions in a long, a little while there. That is awesome. Look how awesome that is. Jeez. So I do have a giveaway for January going on. 
Uh, somebody finally claimed my December giveaway uh, today. I actually had the video go out on uh, Wednesday. This is when I'm filming this. But uh, they, I finally got somebody that claimed that my friend Nissan Raul happened to luckily win. Like, he's been around since the beginning and he hasn't been able to win anything. Even when I had less people on the channel. So, congratulations Nissan Raul, a.k.a. Raul. And uh, we're going to meet up. Because he lives close to me. We're going to meet up and exchange a couple of things. He got some cards for a video for me to open soon. I think he's got like 17 Evolutions packs or maybe more by now for me to open on the channel for him. So that's going to be awesome. I can't wait to do that. I don't think I opened more than like 10 or 12 Evolutions packs at once. Erica's Hospitality, and that is a reverse rare hollow. And we got our first double hit pack of the day. Of course, it's in Hidden Fates because that's how Hidden Fates rolls. So I think Erica's Hospitality might be worth something. We're going to find out. So we're going to put that right there. And Evolution's turn again. Let's see if we can beat that Mega Blastoise EX. I think basically any Charizard beats it, but we're going to see. I'm about to, uh, I got to announce my giveaway. My January giveaway, I just said it. So all you got to do to win this beautiful Ultra Prism card Super Boost Energy Prism card, 2018 in mint condition. Is like this video, so be a subscriber to the channel, turn on your notification bell so you could be updated with new videos and get more entries. Leave a comment down below for an entry. You get one entry per comment per video. It's only one time though. You can only get one entry per video. So feel free to leave a bunch of comments if you want to because it really helps get the channel out there. But only one comment will be worth, uh, you'll only get credit for one of your comments. So yeah, I appreciate all of the comments, of course. We got a flying Pikachu. Still haven't found the surfing Pikachu. This is like my fourth flying one, though. Coughing. Misty's Determination Ponyta. Doduo. Pikachu. I feel like we just got a Pikachu in this, in this pack. All right, we got a Staryu, because we did. It was flying. Uh, Onyx. Uh, oh, dude, this happened twice already. That's so cool. I love it. And we got a Needle King Hollow. Nice. Let's check out the condition because sometimes these prints have lines in them for some reason. The base set had a better print run than this set. But this one looks pretty great, actually. Looks like it got a little tiny mark right above his right side, like a dot. So far, it looks like Evolutions might be winning. Going to push over that little giveaway card for a second there. So you could see what's going on here. All right. So, Burning Shadows and Hidden Fates has some catching up to do. Hopefully, we could get a Charizard out of there. So, let's see, baby. Let's see. We got a Lightning and a Drip, a Potown, Weakness Policy, Heatamore, Rialo, Lolan Grandma, Lady Cutie Fly, Horsey. A Lycan Rock. Yes! We got a Ho OGX Ultra Rare. That is absolutely gorgeous. It look it's like coming off the left side right here. I thought it was miscut or something at first, but they do have the border. And it looks like he's pretty centered, actually. Oh my goodness, they are having an epic battle. Second ultra rare. Second ultra rare for Burning Shadows. And uh I just want to let y'all know where my packs came from today. These Evolution packs came out of some random box sets that I picked up at Walmart or whatever. Burning Shadows as well. And the Hidden Fates packs came out of a Charizard uh, GX-10. The, the reprint tins that just came out in December. Well, it just came out last year, at the end of last year. So that's that. So, so far, the random Burning Shadows packs and Evolution packs are murdering right now. I really wish I knew exactly what box they came out of. But the crazy thing is when I open them in boxes, like box sets, I don't get anything out of them. So, And it was box sets are already open, so you didn't miss anything as far as uh, what comes in a certain box set. So let's see what the last pack can do. We basically need a Charizard and Evolutions. No, I'm thinking of uh, Hidden Fates. Hidden Fates is the one not doing too well. It's only got this so far. That's crazy. So Evolutions of Charizard would definitely put it over the top for sure right now. 
But uh, I think it may be losing the burning shadow. So we're going to see what's going on right now. It's three from the back. <clears throat> Hopefully we can get that Charizard finally. We got a Charmeleon, which is beautiful. Kakuna, Voltorb. I love seeing these old school cards. It's just... It just brings me back. I think that's why the set is so Pikachu. I mean, uh, Pikachu. It's so uh, popular because it's just, you can't beat the, you just can't beat a nostalgic feeling. It's just something that brings you back to the, the good old days, the good times. So Evolutions is going to have to do with that Mega Blastoise, which I think could possibly beat those two Ultra Rares out of Burning Shadows. But the thing is, if Burning Shadows gets another good card right now, it's not going to be looking good. Semipore, at least for not for evolutions. Electabuzz, Panpore, Cutie Fly, Panser, Magic Cat, Ratata, Wimpod, Common, and we got an Alolan Muck to add to Burning Shadows total. Oh my goodness, Burning Shadows is murdering right now. Two ultra rares in a regular rare GX. Wow, bruh. Wow. All right, last pack Hidden Fates. All you got is a reverse dark energy. Let's go. You got to get a shiny. Unless that was like a, a, a poopy tin, which I hope it wasn't. Got to get a shiny full art right now. Let's go. Four from the back, and you got to hit like a Charizard in that second reverse spot. So let's go. Let's get it. Giovanni's Exile. Cobus Trap. Lieutenant Surge's Strategy. We got a Coffin. Clefairy. Starry. Jigglypuff. Lieutenant Surge's strategy. Um, we got a Charizard GX a little too late. He is about eight to nine dollars or so. So that's a little too late. I think you got third place, but awesome last pack for uh Hidden Fates. And we're gonna do the recap, which I think uh which is the, from the lowest person to the highest. And uh let's get it, baby. If you haven't already, make sure you enter the January giveaway. The description below will tell you how to enter uh, each monthly giveaway as of right now, unless something changes. So this is Hidden Fates, Hollow Eevee, Erica's Hospitality Reverse, Charizard GX, and an Energy Reverse Darkness Energy. And we're going to go with whom I think uh, came in second, which I might not be right on this. It might be uh, Burning Shadows who comes in second, depending on what that Blastoise is worth. So we got a Nidoking Hollow, which is beautiful, looks flawless. Except for they got a little dot right there. A Mega Blastoise EX, baby, to complete my collection. Already got the Charizard and the Venusaur. I can't wait to see what prices these things are. So let's get it with the person that I think, the set that I think won today, which in the, was an epic video. I loved it. I love opening sets with a potential chance to pull a Charizard. With that being said, I don't care to open Champion's Path on camera because it most of the time lets me down and the viewers down of course so we got an alolan muck gx a lycanroc lycan rock gx ultra rare and a beautiful ho o gx ultra rare which i think is worth a good bit can't wait to see thank you guys so much for watching today's video and supporting the channel make sure you enter that january giveaway down below for the uh the description or the uh entry rules my bad I love y'all. God bless y'all. Until next time, baby. Peace out.